Hi everybody, in this screencast I'm going to show you how to upload multiple files to Moodle. The general uh, format for uploading files only allows you to upload one file at a time. However, by compressing a folder into a single file, you can upload it and then decompress it once it's on Moodle. That might sound confusing, but I'll show you the steps. Okay, In Moodle, uh, well, you're going to need turn editing on. Now, under I'm going to add it to this section. I'm going to go to the area where I'm going to presumably just uh, link to a file or website. And now, what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to go to Choose or Upload File. And I am going to upload a new file. I'm going to look for the file. And in this case, I'm going to um, assume that I want to upload this Web 2.0 folder. So I'm going to right click on that folder while it's still here and go to Send To. And in this case, I'm going to compress this because I want to send the whole folder up, but I can't do that yet. So I'm going to compress as a zipped fo folder. And then I'm going to click Yes. Now, it created this other, what it perceives as a file, but it's really all of the contents of the folder bundled into a file. In this case, it shows this little icon of these books together. That's because of a certain decompression or compression software on my computer, which you might have, or it might look like a folder with a zipper over it. So regardless, I'm going to click on that, and that's the, the folder or file that I'm going to upload at this point. So I'm going to click Upload this file. This is the status showing it is, in fact, uploading the file. Now, here we go. We've got this web2.zip. Now, what I need to do before I can really use this is I need to unzip this if I want to use files within this or the entire directory. So I'm going to unzip this, and it basically extracted all of the files from this uh, compressed folder. Now I have that as a folder here, which looks a little more normal than this one. And if I click in here, I'll see the contents within this folder. So in this case, if I wanted to just upload um, a certain file, let's say this uh, syllabus, I would go here to choose. And I'm going to now scroll down. I want to have it go in a new window. Um, I want to give it a name, and I'll call this uh, Syllabus, and I might give it a description here. Okay, and now I'll scroll down to the bottom. Remember the things I did. I chose it first. Uh, I decided I wanted it to open in a new window. And I'm going to now save and return to course. Now that's the file that I added. But remember, I added it from a folder. So now all of the different files from that folder are available to me in, within Moodle. In the next screencast, I'm going to show you how to deal with, the, with adding a whole folder to offer for your students. But I wanted to show you first how to upload multiple files, which was with the compressing the folder, uploading the folder, and then utilizing any of the contents that have been uploaded within that folder. So you can take um, any files, like let's say you want to upload 10 files at one time, you could create a folder on your computer, put all those files in it just to save you time, then like I showed you, compress it, upload it, and then have them available. Okay, so that's it for this screencast.